just followed my life, my life, my life, my life in the sunshine. Mary has made a commitment to her fans to always be her authentic self. Now that's, that's real love. Giving us a multitude of hits, amazing live performances, and a collection of songs that has captured the true essence of a woman who's unafraid to bear her soul. She started out as a around the way girl from Yonkers, New York, whose albums took the passion of soul music, combined with hip hop beats to create a new sound. There was simply no merit for merit. Mary J. Blige is just one of those artists I feel like has inspired me to be my authentic self. The vulnerability in her records, the pain in her records, always reminded me of like the blues and the same thing that I felt listening to the blues growing up. The way that she makes me feel empowered, the way that she moves on stage, the way that she shakes her hips, moves her arm, <laughs> it feels so real and raw. People think that it's the moment. Can't be honest or vulnerable or we'll have weak moments, but I think the way you pick yourself back up is what proves how strong you are and Mary embodies that perfectly. Mary J. Blige is a world renowned artist, a sought after collaborator, and most importantly, a woman whose transformation of pain and promise into musical prose connects the generations of real women. I was like in seventh grade learning what real love is and learning what it's like to be without you, just feeling all the feels. Her music is just timeless and it touches my spirit because her music comes from her pain and her experiences. She talks about getting it together. for all women. She allows people into her heart, into her spirit, and uh, I know that could be a heavy cross to bear, but Mary, I thank you so much for being here. Her new work, Good Morning Gorgeous, is the most recent example of her willingness to share the deepest parts of herself. She is both singing our scars and soothing them at the same time. T.T. about to cry. T.T. about to cry, y'all. T.T. about to cry, y'all.
one of our biggest inspirations growing up. So I, I, have, I have a lot to say, so please don't roll the um, wrapping up music over my thing. So the, the way the world is now, I think people think icons are born that way. They become a legend overnight. But that is definitely not the case. It takes a lot of time, hard work, and a lot of surviving trial and error to achieve greatness. What an icon means to me is overcoming obstacles to accomplish the unthinkable and be widely admired for having influence over a multitude of people. And that is what I've always represented. I've been on this journey for a long time, one that didn't always look the way you see me now. One that is filled with a lot of heartache and pain, but God helped me to channel those experiences and emotions into my music, which is where I started in music. <clears throat> now check this out. When Andre Morell and Puff Daddy of Uptown Records introduced the Queen of Hip Hop soul to the world, it was the beginning of a movement. Every inner city girl was recognizing their own and could relate to everything I was saying. And every female artist that came into the game wanted to do everything I was doing and still does to this day. Woo! Yeah. Yeah. Not done. <laughs> I was ghetto fabulous and I still am. <laughs> And I'm not alone now. For so long I was searching for a real love, but I finally found my real love. Yes. And that real love is me. Yes. Journey with me on this next chapter and stars. But last 